Now at 11 tonight, we are tracking new developments in a tragic crash we first reported on Eyewitness News at 6. Grief counselors will be on hand tomorrow for students in Mansfield following the death of a 13-year-old boy today whose identity was just we just learned from from the family. His name is Shane Farrell. Now it happened on East Street by the bike path in Mansfield at 2 this afternoon. That's where Eyewitness News reporter Kelly Sullivan is tonight with more details for us. It's still early in the investigation and not much information is being released, but many people who didn't even know the young boy are stopping by to leave flowers and teddy bears at the spot where the 13-year-old boy lost his life. Amanda Hartnett walked her boys across E Street to pray for another young boy who lost his life. It's so sad. It was a freak accident. He just fell off of his bike and, you know, nothing good. He couldn't be saved. Mansfield police say around 2 o'clock Wednesday afternoon, police responded to a call of a bus accident on East Street near the bike path. The cop said that he had hit like a gap in the sidewalk and fell into the bus. Police didn't release the details on how the accident happened, but say the 13-year-old boy was pronounced dead at the scene. The school bus, which had students on board, was rerouted to Mansfield High School and Qualters Middle School, where parents could pick up children and grief counselors were also on hand. Mansfield Police, the District Attorney's Office, and the State Police Reconstruction Team are now jointly investigating. Many in the community are offering their thoughts and prayers to the family. really wanted to get him something. They knew it was a little boy, so they felt the need to get him a teddy bear and some windmills uh, to show, you know, their sympathy and respect for him. As of Wednesday evening, the superintendent or the police department did not release any information regarding the bus driver. But in a statement released by the victim's family, they are requesting privacy at this time. Reporting in Mansfield with the Southeastern Massachusetts Mobile Newsroom, Kelly Sullivan, Eyewitness News.